Um, I'm going to say that my greatest inspiration, while there were many, um, while I was learning how to cook, um, only because I think it's very important right now to say this person is Charlie Trotter. Um, he was the first chef that taught me that um, excellence and the pursuit of excellence is a lifelong, um, a lifelong journey and um, anything is possible. There are so many rock stars that I would like to say that I am like, but I'm going to take um, the uh, um, emotional route and say that I am very much like Nico Case. Um, very indie, um, very much her own person, and with great melody and um, a roaring, roaring voice. My greatest accomplishment as a chef is um, knowing that there are other people out there that I have made a chef. So my guilty pleasure in food is barbecue pork fried rice with extra bean sprouts and add broccoli. And yes, that is my guilty pleasure. Do not tell my husband, it's a secret. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Come on. My superpower is to, um, I, I, I make people weak in their knees with pastry. Come on, that's cool. It was awesome. I make people weak in their knees, so if people are gonna, like, because they're coming to get me, I go, boom, cookies, and they go, ah, oh, ah, oh, I'm not gonna kill you anymore, right? <laughs> Well, I will tell you, I've done many events, and being at Upper Crust at Paws Up has been a really incredible experience. And I think what it is is that you are, you, you're actually cohabitating with these people for three days, and they sort of become part of the experience, and they actually are baking and learning from you hands on, and they come from all different parts of walks of life and um, it's it's just very unique it's very unique and I think that a lot of people learned and a lot of people grew in their cooking world from this experience and so did I glorious world all right that's a